Ever wondered whether a developing embryo or fetus can actually feel pain? It's a question that sparks huge debates, especially in conversations about pregnancy and abortion. Abortion. To understand it, we need to look at how the nervous system forms. In the earliest weeks of pregnancy, the embryo is still building the very basics. Tiny clusters of cells that will later become the brain and spinal cord. But at this stage, there are no functional pain pathways, no cortex, and no neural connections needed to process pain. As development continues into the fetal stage, nerve fibers start forming. But they don't fully link to the brain's higher centers until much later. Most scientific evidence shows that shows that the ability to consciously experience pain requires a functioning cortex, which doesn't become active until around the third trimester. Before that, any movements or reactions are reflexes, not true pain perception. So while the embryo and early fetus are developing incredibly fast, the capacity to actually feel pain comes much later in pregnancy, 